And then God told them that through their seed, all the nations of the earth would be blessed. Hannah was one little part of that slow-paced promise. Her son Samuel would grow up to be a prophet who would anoint a king named David. And one of David's descendants would, would, would fulfill the promise that God made to Abraham and Sarah centuries before. The climax of that epic occurs a thousand years later and 20 miles south of Shiloh when Jesus is born. Hannah took her son to the house of the Lord and gave him to God. God took his son to the hill of Calvary and gave him to the world. God gave Hannah a son because he needed a prophet to anoint a king whose descendant would rule the world. And he gave his son because you and I needed a savior.